Good morning everybody, welcome back to another day in my life, another vlog. Today there is a little bit of homemaking in there with regards to making some food but something very exciting is happening today. Today we are getting our raised beds. <laughs> we are having our raised beds um, put into the garden. My uncle's coming around to help help us with that and we're getting the manger so that I can start planning the produce that I'm going to be planting. It's going to be a veggie plot so I want to grow, or we want to grow, carrots and parsnips and potatoes and onions and garlic and Gosh, we've got a big list, so it's going to be such fun. Obviously, we can't plant it at the moment because it's still January, but we can start making our list. Um, my uncle's coming between nine and half nine, and then I'm going to we're going, going to help him. But I need to go and have a, some a quiet morning first of all. Ooh, it's five past six, and I'm still not fully awake yet. <laughs> um, what are you doing? What are you doing? Do you, do you, do you go upstairs? He says, will you come upstairs, woman? Stop talking and let's go. <laughs> He's so funny. Um, so yeah, we're going to go upstairs and go and do some reading. Um, and yeah, the other thing I want to try and get back on is to lose a little bit of weight because I just, I can feel it in myself that I don't want to lose a lot, but I could just, I could just feel that I just need to be good and just reduce a little bit. So yeah, I need to do that. Um, I need to, well, I need to plan, plan that out in my bullet journal for this coming week. So, but yeah, aside from that, I don't think I've got anything else to update you on at the moment. I'm going to go and take my mocha. I was trying to drink hot chocolates in the mornings before coffee to see if that made me feel less tired in mid-afternoon. Um, and I can't decide if it's made any, if it's done anything. I, I can't, I mean, because I've tried drinking the mocha and drinking the hot chocolate and I think I've been okay this week. So I don't know. I'm just going to stick with my mocha at the moment because it's something I really enjoy. Apart from Lent this year, Lent 2023, my aunt and I are giving up chocolate, yeah, we're giving up chocolate so the mockers will be going, so I'm, I'll need to find a substitute or something different, to, don't bite me, or something different to have for that, um, and I'm giving up social media this year again, <clears throat> so... But that conversation is for a very different vlog, so I'm going to go now and go and enjoy my morning and I will see all of you lovely people when I'm back and getting things ready for our raised bed. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's going to be such fun, so great and I'm so grateful. Okay, we'll catch up in a bit. Played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, play full and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl, daydreamer, kidnap me, take me back all the way back.
Hello everyone, I'm all ready now. I've kind of just pinned my hair up um, into this sort of style. Um, I, I really should watch some tutorials on vintage hairstyles with long hair so I can kind of recreate some myself. But I think this is okay for now. Can you see Arthi? <laughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> so cute. Um, I'm also doing a new thing where I'm not wearing eye mascara at the moment. I need a new eye mascara. One that's just not the cheap variety. One that's actually like fairly decent because the one that I have um, keeps making my eyes sting. So I need to get a better one. George has just gone to the gym. Um, I need to go to Sainsbury's to get some coffee. So I need to go and do that. And then have my breakfast. And then my uncle will be here ready to start in the garden. I'm gonna give him a bacon sandwich to begin with. So I might see if Sainsbury's have any like nice um, rolls or something for him because I think he would like that. And while I get all that sorted, I'm going to put my camera on charge, transfer my footage over onto my computer and then that will all be ready. I've got the bedding on that's being washed currently so once that's done I'm going to put that in the dryer and once that's dry I'm going to iron it um, hopefully before my grandmother and aunt come round so it's all go but it's it's good so I'm going to crack on I'm going to go to Sainsbury's now this is my uh, gardening attire although I am going to wear a scarf when I go to Sainsbury's because it is cold here in the UK um, I don't even know what the temperature is actually minus three minus three minus three I mean that is not cold in the grand scheme of things but for us Brits it's that's cold well it can get up to like minus five or minus ten in some parts of the UK so um, it's chilly so yeah, I'm going to go, like I said, put my camera on charge, go to Sainsbury's, get my breakfast, get my uncle's breakfast sorted, and then we'll be able to, yeah, crack on, do whatever it is that we're doing. And then when George comes back from the gym, if my uncle needs any more help with him, um, he's going to take over in the garden and I'm going to prep all the food for the feast that we're going to have so you can help me with that. I also need to go put, up some, put on some lipstick but my lipstick is downstairs so yeah anyway with that being said I will catch up with all of you lovely people once the garden work has begun I may not check in physically and talk to you I might do a voiceover or something but um, other than that enjoy the garden transformation like it's been i can't wait to do a house tour in april i'm going to do another house tour in april the same like the same layout as how i did my first house tour which i'll link below or above here if you're interested because so much has changed since last in a year it's incredible so yeah but i'm going to stop rambling i'm going to go and get things done Hello everyone, probably shouldn't be doing this as I'm walking down the stairs but I'm holding onto the banister so I'm being safe, I'm just not putting the camera where you can see me. So the bedding is in the dryer, I've got eggs boiling on the stove, I've had my breakfast, I've washed up, the eggs are overflowing, let me turn that down. Um, yeah, so I'm just waiting for my uncle to arrive. He was running a little bit late, which I'm not mad about because I've been able to have my breakfast just calmly. I sat down, I had a, I had a, uh, a latte. I'm going to make a black coffee in a minute just to keep me going. Um, or I may have a peppermint tea, peppermint green tea. Probably going to have that actually. But I'm also going to prepare the fire um, for and light that at about 11ish um, ready for when my little nana and aunt come over later um, because we don't have radiators down here in 
in the lounge. We have one in, in the hallway and we have one where the back door is, but we don't have a radiator in here or in the kitchen because we've got the fire. But we don't always light the fire because um, George and I aren't here long enough. So by the time we lit, we light a fire, um, it won't it won't have warmed everything up. Do you know what I mean? Does that make sense? Like sometimes we just sit in here for an hour in, of an evening. So, but we are lighting one today because it's going. It, then it'll be on all day. Yeah, and it'll be great. And I'm really looking forward to it. So yeah, let's go and get some wood and wait for my uncle to arrive, basically. Let's go get it sorted. Okay, so thought I'd take you outside to show you what is going to happen. So, as you come out the back door, right, you will see nothing here at the moment, but this is where the manger is going to go, just here. And in the manger, I'm going to have all my strawberry plants in here. So I'll have strawberries and just hang them over, which will be really, really cute. Um, it's freezing out here by the way and then here is fruit corner um, at some point I need to transfer uh, my raspberry plant into this pot here but I highly doubt that's going to happen today because yeah completely solid so that will not be happening today what is that right rubbish okay so yeah this is um, fruit corner so that all will be my fruit my little wreath still going and um, this is my herb and like plant corner although this um, pot is like completely cracked like <laughs> there we go I didn't mean to do that I didn't think it would do that but as you've just seen that's I'm gonna have to ask my uncle to take that away for me when he when they come over Look at the cobwebs, don't they look cool? Anyway, um, and then here, obviously there is nothing here at the moment, but this is where the raised beds will be going. Just here, it's gonna look incredible, look amazing. I just cannot wait, it's gonna be so good. And then there are my little strawberry plants just here got them out because apparently they're hardy so they'll be okay there so yeah, they're all my little straws and then my little greenhouses so yeah I'm going inside now because I'm freezing I'm freezing I don't have a coat on but look at that cobweb oh that's cool I wonder if it's like on that is so cool spiders are so clever oh look at that they're just so clever okay we're going back in now because I'm freezing. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm cold, I'm cold, I'm cold. Okay, we're going in. <sighs> Just one other thing I forgot to mention that's happening today. Today is a big day. Like, tomorrow I'm doing nothing. And Monday I'm doing nothing either. But we're having um, somebody come round to give us a quote for our new front door. We're not getting a new front door till the end of this year, possibly beginning of next year. Um, oh, here's G. Ah, oh, here he is, back from the gym cute there he is very serious on his bike <laughs> but yeah we're getting a new front door so this is our current door it's a wooden one and the reason why we're getting a new front door is because it lets in a lot of damp and sometimes it can be moldy but also it lets in a draft as well quite a quite a bad draft it gets really cold in this part of the house so we're getting a composite door um, which will have no draft no damp weatherproof weather resistant and all that fun stuff but now that my hubby is home 
I'm going to go. So yeah, let's start the vlog, garden vlog, getting the new front door quote vlog, 1950s tea party vlog. It's going to be a full day today everyone, full day. Hello everyone, so I just need to turn this on. Um, we've got the raised beds, they're here, but we're not filling them today because my uncle needs to do a few little extra jobs um, with them. Um, but I obviously will show you when we've put them into place, they look incredible. But yeah, because we're not filling them today, um, there's not going to be a massive amount of vlog to do. You've just seen me prepare some of the food for today, which is really great. Um, and yeah, we're just, I'm just waiting for the door people to arrive to give us our quote. And then, yeah, we're going to just crack on and keep, do the manger. So that'll be really great. I'll film that, um, filling the, com the manger with compost because that'll be so good. And then, what else? We'll put the raised beds into place and that will be exciting. And then have our little Ian and and tea later on. So, it's been, it's going really, really well. They look so good. I can't wait to, the, for the finished result, but the, we just need to do some extra little bits to it to keep, to keep the raised beds secure and long lasting. Um, but aside from that, it's amazing. I'm just making a bacon sandwich because I'm starving and we're not eating proper food till later. And then I'm gonna go and help the boys outside. So yeah, just wanted to give you a bit of an update of this slightly all over the place type vlog. The lights 
darling We could get out of town See the beautiful world around Wanna see it now And get in that car Leave a little note And we'll drive real far Let's get out We can leave this city Let's drive to the open Hello everybody, welcome back. So you'll have just seen our amazing spread for our little tea party which is so cute. My aunt, uncle and grandmother are on their way now. It is 20 to five, so it's like a real supper type meal. Um, what do you think to the raised beds? They look incredible when I stand here. And the manger that's got all the strawberry plants in it is gonna be so good. Um, I know I didn't film a lot of me, so or me sorting out the raised beds or the manger, but George and my uncle were amazing and they kind of just put in like did the the man jobs part of it um so like putting it all together and screwing things and all that sort of stuff so um, my uncle needs to do a couple of more bits to the um raised beds so once he's done that we'll be able to fill it with compost and then in the spring we'll be able to plant our produce and I'm so excited so for now I'm going to conclude this video and um, thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed it it's a like raised bed slash family outing slash Enid Blyton tea I don't know what else I'm gonna call this vlog um, but yeah really really hope you enjoyed it I can't wait to see you all in my next video if you are new to my channel then I would love it if you would subscribe and that helped my little community build I film videos on traditional homemaking and traditional living and yeah if you liked it give it a thumbs up leave me any comments or questions you have down below and I'll be sure to respond have a lovely rest of your weekend and have a great week and I'll see you all next week